eat on Zindagi TV part by Rocket Cheese. Welcome guys, Zen Garden is where we are. In the previous episode, Chef Dan made for us the firecracker sushi and now we are gonna... Eat on Zindagi TV Pop by Rocket Cheese. Welcome, we are here at Zen Garden. Bamboo is the place and Chef Dan is the person. In the previous episode, she made for us the amazing what, what? Firecracker, firecracker sushi, yeah, firecracker <laughs> sushi. I've been having a tough time, you know, recalling all this over here. Uh, my lemonade is giving me cool. So, as we indulge into this, we'll find out more about Chef Dan as well. Very nice, humble person and very fast in cooking as well. So, uh, before we do that, let's, please, I want you to also start eating this. Tell me. You need to have it with a slices. Okay. And I'll put a bit of wasabi on the slices. Oh, okay. Well, See, here in Zen Garden, no formality. No formality, yeah. Oh, that's you nice. Need individual I like that, you know. Or yeah. chopsticks. So I mix a bit of wasabi yeah. in here. Please, even you have to do that. Uh, okay. Yeah? <laughs> you, you eat too much of this. <laughs> I want all the guests here to come like, it's a free. It's it's like a welcoming thing to them that yeah. they are here yeah. to have like a comfort zone. So, so tell us, uh, Zen Garden itself, it's been how long? We've been operating for nine years now. Nine years, yeah. wow. Yeah. Okay. So, we uh, initially opened Bamboo Restaurant for Public last October 2008 and then uh, it followed by Jade Coffee Shop. So at then uh, Bamboo was the first restaurant? Yes, yeah. so Bamboo is yeah. the first restaurant. Just a few months and then after that once we settled here, yeah. that's the time we opened the coffee shop. Okay, so Jade uh, was the second one and there, it's just Jade and Bamboo, right? Yes, or there's another before one? we have a bar but yeah. uh, we converted it in a conferencing facility. Conferencing facility, yeah. nice, yes. nice. And then the kitchen we converted into a pastry kitchen. Okay, so okay. And I know your pizzas are very popular as well. You you know? They don't serve it round, yeah, they serve so it uh, uh, rectangular. Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> We want everything to be unique. <laughs> we don't want to yeah. go for a lot of traditional things. Yeah. We want uh, like a bit of change, a bit of fusion, yeah. a bit of attraction to the guests. So and, I, and, 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 and a few Sundays ago I was here and with my family and the kids and everyone. People are enjoying, you know, it's a nice happy family atmosphere as well. Yes, that's our mission, that's our goal. Yeah. To convert the place into a place wherein you can just uh, mingle, freely socialize yeah. and flaunt your nice dress bags. Uh, nice. <laughs> Classy, a fashion hub. Yeah, yeah. That you can get all types of food that you crave. Yeah, yeah. 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 Or yeah you can have pasta, you can have pizza, you have burgers, uh, noodles. Name yeah, it. A bit of everything is there. We have everything. We have dim sauce, yeah, and uh, yeah. all these are like handmade and uh, homemade. Awesome. Even the sauces, yeah. Great, great. So Please now is from, this? Yeah. This is all we have. For. It's not, it's not that I don't know how to use it, okay? I know, I'll, I'll, tr I'll tell you, you know, I was taught about this, you know, guys. Yeah. You know, it's like... I'm, it's I'm, nice to have it. It's, 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 it's almost, this is how you do it, yeah? yeah? Exactly. I'm trying, yeah, yeah, okay, so. But I'll still use my hands. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna go for this one, yeah, guys. Me, I love to pick it Whoa. with my finger. Look at that. Dip it in a sauce. It's really it's nice. It's, it's freshly made. And as you can see, it is very crunchy, I can just tell it. It's shiny. It's like, a, you know, treasure. It's like a VR. So, I'm, am I supposed to put the whole of it or what? If you can. But <laughs> I can. <laughs> but you see, the good thing about it is put everything in your, okay. in your mouth and then nibble it, try to try all the combination of flavors. Okay, guys, here it goes. Then tell me how is it. Chef Dan is just here. <laughs> if anything happens to me, guys, I love you. <laughs> wow! It's crunchy.
crunchy. Because of flakes and then the caviar. Mm, the chili is there as well. It's not very hot but it's nice. It's different. It's so unique. It's, very it's not like a, a normal sushi. Yeah. It's like a, it's it's a it's a fusion element. You know, if you're wondering about all that noise, no, no, it's like it's yeah. a happening place over here, guys. So, <laughs> yeah. It's it's different. It's nice. It is. I love the crunchiness on it. You actually get to taste uh, uh, the fish as well. The rice is just right. It's not the one you know that you just pick it up and then it starts tearing up. You know with sushi that's the way it should be. Yeah. It should stick. Should but sometimes I know you know when you pick up your rice it starts tearing yeah. apart and that's a big no. So Chef Dan has done a whole bunch. This what is the flaming I'm I'm like calling it flaming all the way because <laughs> Well, because the chili of the aspect of this, yeah, yeah. Here. So but this, the, chili. the firecracker sushi is simply arriva, arriva, arriva. You guys have to try this out. This is a unique sushi. It's 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 not sushi. I mean, it's something else over here. Yeah. But still, the sushi <laughs> element is there, as you saw how she made it. Uh, your own recipe. Kudos to this. This is really good stuff. Yeah. So tell me, Chef Dan, you've been doing this all your life. You cooking? Uh, as far as I can remember, I, I've been so interested in cooking since I was small. Mm -hmm. Because, uh, you mm. know, I love... Now I'm I testing love the balls. What are, what are they called? That's the caviar? Yeah, the caviar. Mm. Now they're coming in. The prawn egg. Nice! Ooh. Once, once it pops, it's like there's a... a like I, can, I, can, I can feel it, yeah. <laughs> It's so like nice, it's, uh, yeah. so interesting. It's so fun to eat. <laughs> it's unique and it should be a snack on its own. <laughs> yeah, you can, can put in avocado uh -huh. and then eat it like that. Nice, nice. Yeah. And it's so healthy, there's no fats. Yeah, so, so tell us more about Chef Dan. You know, you've just won my heart with this invention of yours, you know. Generally, I know recipes are just paper from picked up from there and there with your own creation. So tell me more about yourself. I mean, it's, it's amazing, you know. I mean, I mean I've mean, i got to do a special arriva for this because this is the first female chef who is featured on Zindagi TV. Generally, the, the men are there and, you know, I say that anything a man can do, a woman can do, of course. So, for this, you know, hats off to you, arriva Chef Dan. Chef Dan, tell us more. Okay. Uh, it's, 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 I'm sure it's been a tough ride over here. I, I will say initially it's really a very challenging thing for me yeah. because as a woman here in this country you see the respect and then yeah. the authority is very less. Yeah. Then since I handle the whole kitchen, all the kitchen of uh, uh, Zen Garden, you see we have three kitchens yeah. yeah. So it's it's quite tough but yeah. la later on it's like a norm, a and, norm. and I really enjoyed it uh -huh. because once I, you know, the, the, the thing is in order for you to gain the respect of your staff mm. you need to do it hands-on mm. you need to show them that you can also do the job because if you give, yeah mm. if you keep just on giving instructions and and like uh, just just tell them what to do and even you you're not doing it by yourself then you will not gain any respect there's a question I want to ask you are you you know you're a very nice person you're very soft-spoken you're humble are you like coming in the kitchen I think you need to ask that one of the shots. Yeah, seriously, man. It's like, Actually, she's this, so soft spoken, yeah. and you know, this you is just, my side uh, imagine <laughs> Chef Dan behind the scenes, you know, to be like, why? <laughs> are you like that? I'm more than like that. More than, more, yeah. more to, you know, in the kitchen, you cannot you be have soft. To be. You, you need to be, to be tough. You, need, yeah. you don't need to smile. I cannot smile. You know, I have side A and side B, and I will accept that one. Yeah. yeah huh. uh, really honestly I said that my side A yeah. is my hardest part and my side B is my soft part for yeah, my family, yeah. for my friends, for the dish, guests. Because yes. you know one time it's, it's so funny uh, when you're, you're so funny in the kitchen you keep on shouting your voice raised and you are really like oh, yeah, very tough yeah. and then once you see a nice client who say hi to you then you'll just transform yeah, right yeah, away. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like I mean, the, yeah, so that's it's, amazing. It's, it's, but it's I enjoyed it. You enjoyed yeah, it. Enjoyed and, it and trust me you've done it. I mean nine years Zen Garden and it's it's growing day by day, taking it to greater it, yeah. heights, keep on improving. Uh, and I know all the menus, all the recipes, all the dishes, of course you hand in hand with your directors and all, but you are the, the main person behind this. I mean that's amazing. Yeah. Every single thing you need to know everything. From from the smallest smallest details you need to know everything. So that if in case like for example, you know the stuff turnover is very quick, yeah. yeah, here. yeah, yeah. So if the one stop or one of your your uh, main guy will leave you, at least you know how to you know, do yeah. You need to, for nine years, a lot of turnover has happened already. So.
So there you go, Chef Dan, girl power guys, there you go, you have it. You keep watching, like, share, subscribe. I'm gonna clear this uh, sushi of mine over here. Chef Dan's still with us and we're still here at Zen Garden.